The surf and flood warnings went up Thursday in Coalfield counties including Raleigh, Mingo, Wyoming, and McDowell. Most of the problems were limited to an unseasonable winter road flooding. But McDowell issued a state of emergency with some homes flooded or surrounded by high water. And major roads like US-52 cut by flooding. It is horrific. It's, it's, it's horrible. A lot of roads flooded here in the county? From what I've seen, yeah. We worked until 11 or 12 o'clock and found out it was state of emergency and just now leaving, so trying to make it home. Concerns in those counties and others in southeastern West Virginia will continue into the night. You didn't have to be in a flood warning county to have a flood problem. Mud Fork Road was blocked by high water in Logan County. A rock slide hit near the Benjamin Price Bridge in Boone County. The National Weather Service warns that most flooding deaths occur in vehicles and urges caution with high water issues continuing on many West Virginia secondary roads prone to flooding. Emergency officials will be watching the Tug Fork and Guyandot Rivers. In McDowell County, Bob Aaron, Eyewitness News.